O'Brien. Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Be impeccable with your word. Manifest your true intentions. Regardless of what language you speak, your intent will be manifested through the word. What you dream. What you feel and what you really are will be manifested through what you say each and every day. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 231, NASDAQ up 41, SP's up 16 and a half. Gold, gold contract down $3.90, uh, traded at 2182. We have silver down 15 cents, $25.11 an ounce, light sweet crude up 80 cents, $83.52 a barrel, notes and bonds. 10 year note. Up 10 ticks, trading 110.04, the 30 year, up 19 at 118.25, and King Dollar. King Dollar trading up 268 ticks at 103.847, Euro 108, yen 150, British pound 129 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world, in the world of the S&Ps, as well as the NASDAQ and the NASDAQ 100. At all the indices in general, folks, you had rejection of lower price, and you're going to have lighter volume, and that tells me that tomorrow at 2 o'clock, when the statement comes out, that we're going to go for the highs. The S&P, the SPY went to 511, rejected it. You're at 514 right now. The NDX 100, which is also getting hit, went down into the price point of, uh, let's see, 433, rejected it. You're at 438, and... What you have in the NASDAQ 100, the Qs, is that you get that high volume high at 448. It gave it up on price that day, but guess what? That's a high volume high. So it looks to me that we're going to go higher before we're going to go lower, which is as wild as you can get. Let's, get. let's get over to our man, Mr. Basil Chapman, now, because our man, Mr. Basil Chapman, now, this is really cool, man, that he is doing a, a live webinar today, right after I finish from 4 to 5.30. Now, this is for his subscribers, folks, okay? But you can be a subscriber right here and right now. And the way you do that, you come over to our website at TFNN. You're going to go under Featured Content, and you're going to see it right on the left-hand side, the opening call, Subscriber Webinar. You can hit that button. You can subscribe. It comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee, so the bottom line is that you can take it for 30 days. If it works for you, great. If for some reason it doesn't work for you, you just let us know. You get your full refund. And then what, what you get, of course, is this. Is that you're going to get a great webinar today. Basil already has about 10 to 12 out there. And the webinar today is going to be the technical tools needed for the coming few months. Basil Chapman, what's going on? Hi, Tom. How are you? I'm doing great, man. Yourself? I'm well, thank you. Looking forward to 4 o'clock. It's yeah. exciting, I must say. You get, a, you get a good day. You always pick a good day, even though you don't know what's going to happen. <laughs> I know. It's very interesting. Well, of course, part of it is timing. And we, we had, I, the way I was looking at it, come, come this middle part of March, a lot in the market very often happens in March. So I thought it was an opportune time. But what's really interesting is uh, you were talking about uh, different technical indicators. So I, I'll be talking about technical indicators, but it's not just the technical indicators. It's what stocks and sectors go with us. And that's the, the important thing that I want to be putting together. It's like a package of what stocks we're looking at yes. or any decline, what we want to get. Nice. Uh, doesn't matter the range of prices, whether it's a single digit stock, double digit, it has nothing to do with that. It's the right sector, for instance, even though we're on a very short term basis, we have short positions. We actually have also put on long positions because these are stocks that are sectors that are under the radar and seem to be working. <clears throat> and what's interesting is as we're talking <clears throat> and at four o'clock, the futures are still open for another hour. So that's going to be exciting because. I have a particular one particular indicator. I call it the technical tool of last resort, and that's my 914 moving average. Yes. And you can see, here's the one minute chart. This is just the same as if I was, when I'm going to be doing the, my webinar, I'll be talking about the daily, weekly, monthly. This is the one minute, five minute, and the 10 minute. And you can see 
that this nine period moving average was green and then it went pink in the one minute chart. The green in the, in the five minute chart just ignored it, it couldn't care, but all of a sudden, as we're speaking, it's gone pink. The, the 10 minute, which I would say is like a monthly, has this dreaded H pattern and it's arching over. So this is, I, this is live as we're looking at it. These are the very indicators and I'll show you what we're looking at here. So in the daily chart, Yes, the nine period moving average. It looked so close. Like even this morning in the futures. I heard the you this morning. Went, yes. <laughs> went red. It was going but back said, and forth. I, I was driving on the way in <laughs> when I was listening to you. Yeah. And, and, and the interesting thing is, I said, this is only early in the morning. It's not four o'clock. Anything can happen. The day is young right up until the last five or 10 minutes of the day. So we're going to be watching this very closely because it's getting closer and closer. But if you had to look at the, the IYM, which is the, uh, so I, IWM, the IW, IWM is the, um, now I want to go to the IWM. IWM, look at this. This is the daily chart on the left, both of them daily charts. And there it is, pink. The nine period moving average hasn't been pink since it crossed positive back in the 9th of February. So for a month it's been running, and this has been one of the weaker indices. So we know that bottoms are made in unison, synchronicity because the, the fear factor and everything just comes in together. Tops kind of roll over. Yes. But the fact, the fact that we've got um, the small caps rolling over, the estimations were really close. Estimation, here we go, estimation just saved the day by having a bit of a rally, but it's starting to weaken. So I'm looking at this and I'm going to show the subscribers and people who are joining the webinar how we look at this. It's a, it's a process. I don't want to say this is it, bam. It has to be a process, this particular indicator. And it's an indicator that gives, uh, for instance, there was one day where it went pink in the SMHs, the semiconductor index, right here on the 5th of January. And then by the, um, it was a weekend on the 8th Monday, it went green again and it's green all the way through January, February, and all the way through this very minute that we're talking. And, but it looks folks, very close to turning down. Come over to our website at TFNN. You're gonna see it right under featured content, the opening call, subscribe to the webinar. And remember something, it's four to 5.30 today. If you can't make it live, folks, this is totally archived, okay? So if you want a great webinar, a, a great, uh, knowledge of exactly what Basil does, go do it right now. Basil, you have a great one, safe one. We look forward to the, the seminar at Thank uh, you, 4 o'clock. Thank you, John. Thanks, man. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.